has been sort of your reaction over the past couple of days as we continue to learn more about kind of what's being alleged? Disbelief, you know. I I, sh I don't know, I shouldn't say disbelief, but um, I, it's sad. You know, it's it's sad in on a lot of respects. I feel bad for the people involved, even though it's you know you you kind of bring things on yourself. But I I think obviously our game needs fixing the game, not itself, but the the, the things around the game. Um, and I've said this before, you know, that to me there's two buckets that we're dealing with here when it comes to this. You got players and their families allegedly taking money. Um, two different ways. One is through the recruiting process to go to a certain school. The other is once they're on campus and, and agents are coming at them because they're highly sought after kids and, and basically big time assets that people want to get their hooks into. So they're two different issues and I think they have to be, you have to separate them. You can't rush to judgment. Uh, we all want to, you see a name, you see a university, but you know some of them are ticky tack things and some of them are pretty big things and I think you know each school has to deal with it deal with it themselves I know the NCAA is trying to digest the whole thing as as a whole and it's uh, difficult times but sad uh, was my reaction and and uh, I'm concerned about cleaning up the recruiting part that's to me as the head coach of Colorado what bothers me the most that's what I want to see fixed fixed first the other part we can we can fix if we choose to fix it you know with our amateurism definitions but the recruiting part, now that's been going on for 50 years or however long, you know, uh, sports have, have, have been in, in college, but uh, it's sad.